everybody. Hope everybody's doing fine. Kaliso Riff here, bringing you a quick update and an upgrade I did to the Nano Reef. I know it's been a minute since I haven't made videos, <clears throat> you know, letting you guys know what's going on. So, let's start with this one. Um, as you guys can see, I added skimmer to the tank. I was debating if I was going to add one to it um, because of the space. You know, I don't have that much space. I didn't want to have nothing in the background showing. But, you know, since I added the seahorse to the tank and I got five fishes in total in there, it's a small little tank. So, the best I could filtrate the water, the best I could filtrate the water, the better. All right. So... You know, went online, checking, see what skimmer I was going to go with. And I had the Nano Biocube skimmer before, and I didn't I didn't have good results with it. I was having a lot of problems that I let down, so it could, you know, um, skim good. And I was having a lot of problems in the past. Uh, good thing about it, the skimmer come with a pump. So... Hey, if you guys want to get something with everything on it, skimmer and pump, you know, air driven, um, air pump. So go ahead, get that one. But, um, I was searching online and came across this one. And the first thing I like about it, it got a slim profile. So it got a big collection cup with a drainer. So you could drain all the nasty stuff. It got a hang on bracket. It'll have suction cups like the Nano Skimmer BioCube that I didn't like much because of that. You know, it had the suction cups and the skimmer was falling too much. So um, once I saw this one, I said this, this one is perfect. Um, I did an upgrade to it. I changed the, <clears throat> the air stone. I put the Coral Life Airstone, the one that comes with the Nano um, BioQ skimmer. I added that one to this skimmer just, you know, just because I like that one. And, I mean, I tried this one. And it was good. It was working fine. I just, you know, wanted to have the Coral Life one, which, if you guys can see, it says it on the Airstone. So, that's one thing I like about that. So, yeah, so, you know, like I say, since I have... Five inches in the tank. It's a lot of nutrient. I do a lot of feeding to this little tank. So, um, the best I can um, filter the water, the better. And I'm going to be removing the reactor, the shader reactor I add to the tank. Just so I can have that free space in the back. But, this is the skimmer. This is my review on it. Like I say, I like the collection cup, the drain. I got a water bottle on the back. Of the tank you can see it that much so that's a good that's a plus um the ear bubble chamber is long that's another part i like about it and like i say so far so good since i connected it um the other day is performing perfect i didn't have to i didn't have to go through a lot of trouble adjusting it so I can skim, so I can start doing some skimming, and so far, so good. But yeah, this is what's going on in the tank. Sorry, I, I was changing the filter flaws on the tank. And this is what's going on, you know. Tank is doing great. Fish are doing fine. Seahorse still, seahorsing around. It's a little bit dirty since I removed the filter floss. So you see all this. But talking back about the skimmer, one thing I like, like the BioQ Nano skimmer, the um, micro bubbles was escaping a lot through the bottom. This one, the way they did it is perfect because as you guys can see, you know, there's no air bubbles or micro bubbles coming out through the bottom. Everything just going up, 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 and start and skimming in the top. So that's that's what I like about this skimmer a lot. So the only bad thing, it'll come with an air pump. That's the only bad thing about it. 
But other than that, you know, I found this one in, in eBay. On eBay. So it came from China. So if you're not in a rush, you know, to get it, you know, like if you could sit down and wait, then, you know, you guys could order it. Like I said, the name is Diamond IQ Skimmer. IQ Series, clip on device, easy installation, air driven system, suitable for more mini tanks. And, you know, all I paid for it was $22. I'm pretty sure that they got all the skimmers in there, but I didn't want nothing with a pump. I want an air driven one, so I went with this one. So, if you guys, you know, need one, then go on eBay, you guys will find it. So, yep, so what's going on in the little nano? Everybody's doing great. I just fed the tank, so look at the seahorse. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful seahorse, man. I fell in love with them now, so that's a problem because I'm going to be getting more soon. Then I got this two clowns, not getting along. The little frostbite clown used to host the Duncan Coral. And when I added the the black ice snowflake clown, he kicked them out of the Duncan Coral. So I guess it's a female thing. <laughs> but yeah, so the tank is doing great. Um, this little Gorgonian is not doing that great. I had in the tank upstairs and started algae started growing on it so i decided to bring it back down here to this tank but yeah this is this is my update on the tank you know for those that want to do a nano reef and think it's impossible it's possible uh, one way i deal with the evaporation i have a lid a plexiglass lid i added to it and trust that thing works that thing works because I add water to this tank uh, I will say twice a week compared to the quarantine tank which I gotta add water soon as you guys can see I do the little lines on it and it's way below way below the line that I always do so I add water to this tank every single day and I don't have no lid. And this one, since I added the lid, I always check in my salinity, um, making sure there's, there's not a lot of changes in it. And so far, so good. I don't get that much evaporation in the tank since I added the lid. And filtration, nitrates is zero, ammonia is zero, nitrites is zero. Everything is, is thriving, so although they're scared to do an on a reef, you know, and just you know, if, if just test the water and do the right thing, do the right thing, just test, 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 and, and look for options so you don't have to so the tank don't crash on you, all right? So, thank you, thank you for watching, and you know, if you like the video, hit the like button and subscribe if you haven't. And any suggestion, any comments, leave it in the comment section below. All right, shout out to everybody and happy late Thanksgiving. Hope everybody's have, having a wonderful week. All right, Kalisa's week out. Thank you for watching.